Hello darlings, how lovely to see you. Welcome to Tammy and Bert's Utopia, live from here in country Ballarat, in Victoria, Australia. Let me know if you're watching from anywhere around the world. I would love to know where my 35 subscribers live. I know that probably 30 of them are family, so thank you darlings all to my family who actually watch my silly little things and see what I've done for the week. So thank you. Special love to Kai and Paige and Emma and Oscar and Bailey, never forget Bailey. Oh no, all my darling grandchildren. So it's been a wonderful week this week. We have the fridge fixed. So I was very lucky because my, my dear friend Anna Marie lent us a fridge on the weekend, a, a small one, which was very handy because we had to defrost it for two days before it was fixed. And so she lent us that, it was her parents, it is her parents, and we had that one going and it was wonderful. And then I, I was talking to Ben and I mentioned to him and he said, oh mum, I'll bring around the car fridge. So he brought around his car fridge that lives in his car. Now this is a big thing because you know tradies and their food and their their drinks they have to be chilled because it gets very hot here in Ballarat so anyway he brought that around and we successfully uh, um, unloaded all into that with the two fridges we've been fine and Wayne from Barclays came yesterday and he has fixed it so this afternoon I will be stocking up my fridge and freezer because as you know everything was lost so it's going to be a quite expensive afternoon but that's fine I'll be very happy to up to um, fill it up again so also this week what's happened oh I've had so much love love from my granddaughters this week oh Emma my little granddaughter has been at school collecting rocks for nanny now that is something that is pure love she knows how much I love rocks now she has spent her recesses and her lunch times, if you can see them, collecting these beautiful pieces of rocks, which mum has successfully washed perfectly and put in a pretty bag for Nanny. And then she gave them to me, and I feel so humble because what she did was she had a story with every single rock. And the thing is that, you know, every little piece she told me where she got it, and who was with her when she got it. So I felt so loved by Emma with that. So special thank you, Emma. You know how much Nanny loves rocks. Nanny loves rocks. And I've had an invitation from my other granddaughter, darling Paige. Woohoo! It's Grandparents Week! And Nanny loves Grandparents Week. So that is why Nanny has the crown on. Because Grandparents Week, it's the one week of the year where we are treated like royalty when we go to the schools. So Nanny has popped a crown on today because I'm feeling very royal. Because I'm off to the Grandparents Week this Friday to the Garden Festival at the Alfredham Primary School and it will be absolutely fantastic. And Kai and Paige have made these incredibly oh, intricate things. I mean, I offered up a big weed from the garden that I had been growing for them but they're long past dragging along weeds so anyway they've created their own little things and that's just beautiful I can't wait to see how they go and also the other news of the week this week is dearest Oscar has lost his favorite bus driver Craig has gone on to better pastures driving for Loretto now so he's got a different bus driver and it's a lady and he was telling me all about that. So he says that he'll get used to her and it will be fine. So that's all right because he had quite a close relationship with his last bus driver. So anyway, my grandchildren have given me so much love this week and I just feel so blessed to have them. Aren't they the best? They're absolutely the best. So I've got a crown on because of Grandparents Week and because my darling Simone Elise no, <laughs> silly, silly, silly. She lent me all of her crowns. Oh my goodness, haven't I had fun? Which one will I wear? I feel so lucky, I feel royal. The weight of the crown on the head, oh my goodness, it's just wonderful to be a grandparent. There is wisdom that comes with age, you know. Wisdom, whether people want to listen or not, we can rattle on and tell them. So that's really good. And I also, this week, 
I've been noticing how much colour makes me so happy. I think I've told you this before. I never feel happier than when I'm dressed up with some bright lippy on. I wear lipstick every single day. And, you know, the eyebrows on and you just look at yourself and you feel, well, yes, you. I can see you now because you tend to disappear as you get older. I don't know if you know, ladies notice that, but something happens and our eyebrows just disappear, our lips disappear. And all we see are the, fur the furrow lines in the sides and around the eyes. So they're my lines of wisdom, I call them. So I don't want to lose any of those. So I'm feeling very, very happy. It's been a very happy week this week. So what's on for today? I actually had a parcel in the mail. Now, one thing that makes me very happy is getting post. I buy things for myself all the time. By the time they get here, I have completely forgotten what they are and I'm always surprised and I'm like a little child when I receive them. I'll just pop those down there. So oh, this is what I have got from this lovely person on Etsy and she's done a beautiful job packaging it because they just do, don't they? They just know how to do those sorts of things. Anyway, I want you to see what's in it. Look at this little heart she's given me. Oh my goodness, I just adore that. Put that over there, put that over there. It's something that makes me happy. Things make me happy. Oh my goodness, look. Oh look, it's got a tea bag in it. And I really love English breakfast tea, so that will be used. And this is the happiest thing because colour makes me happy. I don't know about you, but you've got to have a bit of colour in your life. And this is a garland that I'm going to hang up in my lounge room. So look at this, isn't it wonderful? Ladies and gentlemen, what do you think? Isn't it beautiful? Look at that. So I'll show you, I'll hang it up in my, in my lounge room and I'll show you how it is. Look at all the little stars on it. And they've, oh, it's so beautifully and so, done so well and just so cheerful. So I'm going to hang that up in a moment and see what you think where I've chosen to put it. Because like I say, a pop of colour does wonders, doesn't it? You know, we see our face when it lights up when we put some makeup on. So thank you very much to Pot of Tea for this. This video is not sponsored by any way. But for Pot of Tea for making this because I appreciate the time that goes into things because after all, I'm a crafter and a hooker myself. So I know... I know just how much work goes into things, so I'm happy to pay somebody to do things. Oh, he's back again. I don't know how I go putting the garland up with my crown in, but I'll try. I'll give it a go. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Don't we love our royals? Or wouldn't we be lost without our royals? Mm. Love our queen. Love all of our royals. Uh, still a bit icky with Camilla and Charles, but I'm warming up a little bit. Anyway, darlings, what do you think of the garland? Isn't it magnificent? Thank you, pot of tea. Absolutely love it. It will make me happy, happy, happy. It just looks perfect. So what did I tell you? Wasn't it spectacular? Isn't it spectacular? just makes you so happy just looking at it. So I'm hoping that you enjoyed the video. If you did, click like, share, subscribe, all those things. Leave me a comment. Let me know if you like the crown or which crowns you like. Um, a big thank you to Simone for actually lending them to me and her beautiful candelabra and her peacock feathers. And that was just wonderful to have these things that made me feel special on Grandparents Week and to have fun doing a different video altogether. As you know, I love the royals, I love crowns, and to be honest, yeah, I'm looking forward to handing this back to Simi Elise. 
But you know what? I will hand it back because they all belong to her. Thank you, Simone Elise. Mwah, mwah, mwah. All right then. Bye-bye, everybody. Have a wonderful week. God bless. Love you.